Hi, hi everybody. Thank you for tuning in. This is Wellness Wednesday. Today's topic is three changes that you can do to naturally lose weight and to gain overall wellness. There's three tips. And the first one is really listening to your body. Clues are abundant in our words and in body signals. So first, slow down to listen to the signals your body is already telling you. You can clue into the things that you're saying, and you can also clue into your body signals. So one of these is, are you uh, constantly maybe having an ants? Those are automatic negative thoughts that maybe are running around in your head. That is a clue that you are really requiring to slow down. <laughs> and I mean that, slow way down and start to listen to the clues that your body is sending you. When you slow down, you can also find that you can get into more of your ease. And that's a difference between what's called, that's your parasympathetic nervous system, which is ease, it's rest and digest. That's a healthy state to be in. The opposite is often found though. We're in a lot of fight or flight. And especially recently, since COVID has been around, there's a lot of anxiety, a lot of doubts and fears. Those are resident also on the vibration of you being into your sympathetic nervous system, which is fight or flight. And that's, oh, I'm always in fear. <sighs> when we can slow down and rest, you can hear your body signals better. The number two tip is to check your energy level. Do you wake up with good energy? Are you already awake and alive and ready to hit the day? Or, and even if you do reach for coffee, it's okay, but do you find that you're reaching coffee more often because you're craving that caffeine hit? That's a different signal than just enjoying coffee once in a while. If you're addicted to it, slow down and ask yourself why. Why am I lacking energy first thing in the morning? Or, and especially if you're doing it again in the afternoon. If you find yourself hitting that coffee bar again around three or four o'clock, ask yourself why. This is an important clue to why you might have uh, too many things going on and require slowing down. As well as how are you slowing down in the afternoon or the evening? Are you still in your thoughts? Are you processing so much? It's hard to slow down naturally. Maybe you're gravitating towards wine or a cocktail every evening or other substances to help you get into relaxing so that you can even sleep. And even ask yourself, how is your sleep? You should be sleeping more when you're in your ease and in that parasympathetic, lovely rest and digest nervous system. The third tip is cravings. Are you experiencing cravings? This is a great way to clue in to your body. I'm gonna ask you a couple things. One, are you craving sugar? If you find that you're gravitating naturally towards sweets, I'm gonna ask you to do two things. One, normally when you have a sweet, you're gonna take and you'll be satisfied if you actually had a fat. Your body's craving fats and a lovely, healthy fat, like a little bit of avocado, um, some healthy nuts and seeds. Those would be a wonderful way to overcome that. Just a little bit of a natural fat should overcome that sweetness craving. And I'm gonna ask you a new question. Maybe you haven't even heard this before. A body signal for um, craving sweets. I'm gonna ask you, what is your view on life? Do you have a view of life is bitter and you desire more sweetness from life? That is also a signal that you should be slowing down and finding why you're looking at life that way because that is a very common body signal for people who are pre-diabetic. They've lost the sweetness for life. And I'm lovely that we can help with that as well. We talk about decrees and or word codes in my program. So I'd love to help in this area. This is one that found I found great, immense value in myself. And I also know some of our clients who have switched and no longer craving those sweets because they've been completely satisfied now and find sweetness of life again returning. So those are some of those tips. I also have a tip about salt. If you crave salt, which I too often do, I will suggest that you require minerals. 
Minerals are essential for every cell function in your body. Get extra minerals, potentially with some celery juice is a wonderful way in the morning. Also taking minerals, as well as I advocate for pink salt. So these are some healthy three simple tips that you can use to naturally lose weight. Your body aligns when it's all aligned. You desire losing weight naturally and craving healthy natural foods, and then you will learn to lose weight and live well. So if you're interested in any kind of a session, I have two offers. One is a free consultation with me. That's over the phone. I'm gonna allow, we can get on and talk on the phone or Zoom for 20 minutes. And I'd love to do that with you. The offer and the link will be below. In addition to this, you can come into this office. We are open and I'd love it when you come in. That's a special deal right now for $27. You'll meet with me. I'll do a full consult with you, a health history, as well as a body composition analysis. And this is an opportunity to go over 15 different metrics about your health and us uh, sitting down and really giving you a game plan moving forward. I have several programs that I do in our Cypress office. I welcome all opportunities to talk with you and thank you so much and welcome to Discover Wellness and learn to live well.